Welcome to the Sykes & Company PA video blog featuring Alan Sykes. Alan, ideally the pharmacy owners listening to this video have already completed their taxes uh, now that we're in second quarter of 2017. How do they know they're getting the best deal from their accountant? If you look back to see um, what kind of interactions that you're having with your professional accountant, and what I mean by that is is your uh, is your accountant relating relating to you on the fifteenth of April each year with a call saying, "Oh, by the way, I need X dollars to pay, uh, and I've got to file an extension," or is that accountant giving that call to you in August and saying, "Okay, based on the latest inventory you took at the end of June, your numbers are in this particular position, and I think we have the options to consider A, B, C, and D." For the remainder of the year, and if we do A, it's we're looking at potentially these numbers. If we do B, these, etc. So, being proactive from an accounting slash tax perspective um, and, and a general financial status, uh, being proactive, having timely, real-time information, uh, not having to play catch-up ball, not putting returns on extension. Uh, allows you to take advantage of all the appropriate tax uh, advantageous matters that uh, p- that are provided to you in today's environment, which are pretty massive. And obviously, with the p- proposed tax legislation that a lot of people seem to think that in 17 we'll see for the remainder of the year, uh, at least by the end of the year, it'll be very, very important to follow this even cl- more closely uh, to optimize the situation for the for the pharmacy owner. Uh, tax rates and, and, and credits and deductions may change very dramatically even in, in 2017 as we go forward. So, again, being very proactive on this is extraordinarily important. So if you're not in a proactive real-time situation and you're just getting that year-end call on April 15th saying, I need this amount of money to, to send in with your estimate, then generally speaking, you're probably not in a position that you need to be in to know and understand uh, and to maximize your position as a pharmacy owner. And your clients who have really learned how to take advantage of having a proactive accountant, what do they most commonly call you to ask about? Well, first of all, they don't call. They go online, they click, and we do a video conversation, and we bring up the financial statements on the screen and go through them. And they have the free, uh, free-flowing free flexibility to do that 24-7, literally, through our website. So we like to connect with them just like we're connecting here on this video. Uh, we like to bring up the financials and the uh, and the cloud-based financial metrics uh, information that we're tracking on the pharmacy uh, to compare their pharmacy with other pharmacies of similar size that we, we share that information with to make sure that they understand where their, their key metrics are. Um, but, but those are the kinds of things uh, that help us prepare for the end of the year. And quite frankly, the most stressful time of the year for us is in the late summer, early fall, as we begin the, the decision-making process, after we get a good feel on where that particular tax year is, um, and, and begin to discuss those with, with the pharmacy clients, because those are when the hard decisions are made. Uh, the, the, the first quarter of the year, which is the, the compliance time, is just a complete the rest of the information that's needed to, to, to file the tax returns timely. Uh, and again, this year we had no tax returns that were put on extension as a result of our firm with respect to the 315 deadline. And most of our pharmacies do have a 315 deadline with them being either partnerships or most of them being S Corp. So that's really important. But the, the, the hard work needs to be done uh, between now and the, uh, the, the October time frame. Thank you for joining us today. If you want more information or have any questions, please feel free to contact Allen directly.